Hey guys, what's up? Um, someone helped me, um, what to do. My voice is kinda messed up. Apparently if you come here, um, you talk to him, you give him gold, he'll actually level you up. So I had him level up my party to 50. So I don't have my upgraded weapons anymore like I did last time I tried to battle them, but, um, I should be, um, more powerful now. I should be, I should be able to beat them. Where's mine and... Okay, sorry about that. Some people don't know how to knock. And we can just skip through all this because we already know who the murderer is. You didn't want to kill Turntop and blah blah blah. You want to kill Vishon Vardy. Um, yes. But how? Well, we already went through all this the last video. So, um, if you guys didn't watch the last video, you better go back to that video. But why does he hate my dad? Yeah, yeah. Maybe I should skip right to the battle. I don't know. I don't think there's anything for me left to say, like, choice-wise. Even though I did this all last video, I just wanted to start recording so I could show off the glitch fairy. Okay. Maybe I should just go ahead and skip to the battle. And here we are. We, um... I don't know if Helga is level 50 or not, but, I mean, Lightning Bolt. Magics. Heavens, well, do we not get anything else for being level 50? Heavens Wrath. Ice Forth. Magic. Ooh, attack. Real criminal, foreign criminal. Maybe we won't have. That was actually really good right there. Attack. Actually, we have some really, really weak attack. I don't know if I'll be able to. I don't know if I'll be able to do this now. Oh, oh, we beat him. Oh, we might be able to do it. We might be able to do it. Helga will be the entire reason we will we will win. Heaven's Wrath again. Helga, you're fine. Just stay alive. We got to keep Helga alive because... She's the one who does everything. The most damage wise. Oh. Oh. Magic. Oh, we're so close, guys. We're so close. Oh, man. I think we can still do it even if Helga's dead. Attack. I believe we can still do it. Magic. Heaven's Wrath again. No, it's okay. Oh, but we still got plenty of health. We still got plenty of health. Magic. Heaven's Wrath again. Oh my god, guys. We're going to do it. Oh, that glitch fairy was so helpful. So, so helpful. I'm glad someone pointed him out to me. I didn't think I was going to be able to beat the game. But I did it. Kinlum's party was victorious. Oh, man. No, no. No, are you quite finished? Yeah. Boys, 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 I'm sure we can come to some understanding. Let's just talk this out. If you really want to talk, you would never have drawn your sword. You will face the law, even if I have to drag into the cell myself. Hey, whoa, no need to get nasty. We could talk this over, and maybe you can get me some nice gold out of it. Man, seize him. Thank you all for your help. I knew that we would get that man behind bars one day, but I expect it to be years from now. And it's not because your guards didn't do a good investigation. Doesn't it make you feel good about yourself when the guards can't protect their own town? I apologize. Usually this doesn't happen. My men have been spread rather than recently, and it didn't help Major Burns came. We could be glad at least everything worked out. Miss Burns, if you hadn't come in when you had, I fear this cold war with the drought would have escalated to all-out war. We missed Mr. Knox's things for that. If he hadn't grown 
If he hadn't gotten thrown in jail, I would never have gone to visit. But if it went for Caleb, the body wouldn't have been found much until much later. What well, is done is done. There's no need to argue over what will ha never happen. I accept the point. Fine. Though I feel like celebrating, unless I can make Papa realize how close he can die and he won't throw a party. Okay. Quit that just remind me of something. See you guys later, okay? Anyway, you, you need to go. Yeah, since I'm no longer stuck from under, I was hoping to see Tevita has anything for this bruise. It looks like Los Angeles feels. Hmm, yes. That would be problem like if he showed up to Quintus party like that. I suppose, yes. I thought I might as well leave too. And anyway, we was just a hurry. It's obvious I'm no longer needed, so I might as well leave. Frost Cap, of course. Don't worry. I should have visited when I come back in a few years. Really? There's party in hell, particularly in your name. going back to the mountains. I don't know if there's actually going to be a celebration. He says, I have all in me is this bad armor. Well, seriously, all you have? Perhaps. What of it? If you need a tuxedo, I've got a spare line on here somewhere. Don't trouble yourself. I doubt they even noticed I was gone. You're going and that's final. <laughs> Sigh. This is ridiculous. You look fine. That's not what I meant. Why do people bother themselves with wearing impractical stiff clothing for social occasions? It's expected mostly. Since when it become an expectation to wear a fabric noose around the neck, the only news I see is having it make it easy for the enemy to kill you. I do not have to write the rules of society, I just follow them. I still stand my previous statement. Look, if I make you feel better, your regular clothes are in the box over there. If you go desire, you can always change back. Thank you. I'll see you there. Um, uh, I'm assuming the party is at Quintus. Oops. Too bad, oh, well, I think I have enough gold now to upgrade my weapons if I wanted to, but I have no reason to. Um, I'm gonna go see Tabitha, to go to Tabitha's real quick, to just see Helga. Just in case she wants me to go with her. Oh, close right now. All right, no, that's, not help, not, sorry, uh, Whatever her name was, Tabitha. Why well, was I thinking Leonard? Oh, I guess we can't. Okay, so let's go ahead and go to Quintus' party. I am not going to go back to Frostcap without them. Who are you? No. Oh, too much staring. Okay. Now let's see if we can go in here. Yes, we can. Whoa. Calm down. Um, it's good to see you, friend. It's good to see you, too, though I didn't realize I had been updated to the size of a friend. I trust you're enjoying yourself. How all these preparations we put together in such a short amount of time is outstanding. You have done a marvelous job. They have, haven't they? They've been well paid for the highest effort. That sounds reasonable. Yeah, I sense that you're not enjoying yourself. I apologize. I'm not usually invited to social gatherings like this. The rest of my spirits will light when I'm lived when I meet with Quinta at Fargo. Do you happen to know where they will be by chance? At this moment, no. I haven't seen Fargo all evening. Quinta still has to come downstairs. Thank you. So, screw Fargo. Let's find Quinta. Link. I'll be fine. We like something shiny. It's just a cargo ship. Cargo ship? Okay. Who are you? Mm, more. Okay, I bet Quinta's up here. Yep. I want to save game on four, and just in case. Good evening. Oh, hello, Kalem. Quinta. You look lovely this evening. Thanks. You too, I mean. Thank you. Am I if I join you? No, go ahead. I would never have guessed. Mm -hmm. We've, when we first met, I never would imagine you were this wealthy. <laughs> I'm a hunter for the hunt. If I needed the money, I think I'm smart enough to find something that pays more. You're fortunate to have that choice, I, I guess. But beats listening to my mom and Fargo's mother argue over all, my father all day, I suppose. Why aren't you at the party, huh? It's curious. You were the one who wanted to celebrate the most, yet you, here you are now participating. Well, you know, it's a bit stuffier than I hoped. Heck, it's not too much of a party as a social obligated event now. After all this stress with Helga, I wanted to let loose while my dad provided free booze. Well, I admit, what's going on now since it's rather dull. <laughs> Some party. Is this as nice if you ask me how you think so? I've never been one for socializing. If I were then, I would never be living in Frostcap. Yeah, I agree you're a loner, but how is this better than a free booze party? In a good number of ways. The calm after the storm. The stillness of the evening. The satisfaction after a job well done. 
Quality time with you. Oh, shut up, you big sap. I thought you really mean that, don't I? Well, yeah, I mean, you're probably just trying to butter me up so that you'll inherit the fortune when I do. Go to you are by far the strongest, most capable hunter I know regardless of gender. You're clever, you're determined, and you're beautiful. I could care, couldn't care less about whatever price of your draw comes at. If then I just told you it's a lie, then I give you full permission to draw and quarter me until there's not one piece of my distant full corpse intact. Are you... Is that a confession? I suppose it is. Wow, I apologize I'm explaining this on you so suddenly, but... Well, that was sudden. Well, sorry. That was unexpected. <laughs> oh my gosh, what am I doing? Hmm? This can't work. This can never work. And here I'm leading you on. Ugh, I'm such an idiot. You're saying that the kiss wasn't genuine? No, it, it was. It's just... Just... Yeah, look at me. Look around you. Do you really think my dad would give me a sit if I married some caveman from the mountains? You think of me as a caveman? No. My dad would. You're worried about not getting the inheritance. Yeah. It's just... Arg. I... I don't know. What should we do? Um, come with me, and we can live with me in Frostcap. You are a strong, capable hunter, Quinta. You don't need your father's fortune. What? And let Fargo get the money? Who cares about the money? Who cares about the money? Well, I do, but Quinta, no. No. Okay, Quinta. The next day. C Calum. Finally, you're really hard to track down, you know that. Forgive me if I'm wrong, but the interpression of last night's events were that you never wanted to see me again. Oh, come on, Caleb. I never said that. Well, you didn't particularly seem to know about my suggestion. Yeah, that's why I'm here, actually. I'm all ears. I, I did a lot of thinking about last night, and it's funny, you know? I never thought I'd be saying this anything like this, like, ever. But I think I love you. You think? Yeah, it's weird, isn't it? No, I mean, you're not sure? Well, no, not really. You're human, right? You know how complicated emotions are. Apparently not, since I'm just a caveman from the mountains. Haha, <laughs> cute. I already told you that I didn't mean it. Anyway, even if I had no idea what I feel for you, I do know this. I love being around you. Being a hunter makes me feel alive, but hunting with me makes it feel good to be alive. You don't look down on me because I'm a woman, like a lot of other hunters. Heck, other people do. You say things that I never would have thought of. I never know what to expect. And not to mention, you're like, like a pretty cool hunter, too. You take sissy healing magic and make it practical. So, what are you trying to tell me exactly? Look, Caleb, what I said... I changed my mind. I never, if I, I've never needed Papa's fortune, and it's really only holding me back from the life I wanted to live. So to answer your question, I decided that I'd rather be with you in my life than be unhappy without you. I see. So, Caleb, what do you say? I say that you have some wounds that need treating, and the last thing we want for you is to get an infection. What? The stain on my arm? It's, it's nothing. On the contrary, I believe it's best that I get a closer look. Caleb. Now, my, my just house is over here. I said we get you inside so I can have a proper diagnosis. Oh, you tease. You just wanted an excuse for us to go inside, didn't you? <laughs> Maybe. But this has a cut. But this that cut doesn't need some attention. Hat, you're called, Doc. But I expect you to heal any hickeys you hear. Wait, what? Achievement hunting. Affection healing. Her healing would get a lot faster. Oh, I didn't get to read it. Okay, guys, um, that's the end of this game. Um, I want to thank you guys so much for watching this series. Um, it's been pretty fun to play. Um, it went a lot shorter if I didn't um, do all those side quests. But, hey, whatever. Um, I got plenty of other games to play. So, I mean, this is going to be the last let's play for a while. I am so much sad that it's over already. But, yeah, um, I'm just going to let the credits roll because it's some really pretty cool artwork. Ah, uh, wow, is that censored? That is weird. Thanks for playing. You're quite welcome. Yep. That was really worth the money I paid. I bought it on sale, but it was really worth it. So, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next Let's Play.